Good morning and welcome to Australia. It is Sunday, the 15th day of spring, and this is the first episode since the autumn update. So let's check the mail and then we'll see what's going on with that. So we've got 5,000 dink from rain, just from doing stuff for the town. And we got our traps and 6,400 each, I believe, for the kangaroo that we caught yesterday. So we'll throw the traps up there and what else? I'll grab these things. And we'll take care of our animals. Uh, let me say hi to everybody. Ooh, I just noticed that. Look at that. Stamina regen. And well rested. Slight stamina recovery for a good night's rest. Well, those are new. And that was accidental. <laughs> Okay, let me start petting everybody. Carly, Carla, Phoenix, Riley, and I think I have another chick somewhere. Oh, there we are. Karma. Great, so nobody was ignored today. And now we'll Shear and pet Daniela. Pick up some of the poop and the eggs. All right, and I'm gonna get rid of those daisies and the grass there. What is that? Did you see that? There's like a little circle that lit up just now. Let me see if I can get it to happen again. Grass seed. I wonder why... I wonder why it's doing that when I... Huh. That's weird. I wonder if it's like an indication that I'm using stamina? No, because it only does it for grass seed. See if I just do it for a flower, it doesn't seem to do it. That's weird. But you know what? I'm going <laughs> to... I'm going to get a bunch of these paper daisies anyway because I just found out that they're worth quite a bit of money. So I'm just going to take a few minutes to grab some of these. I wonder if that's my stamina regenerating or something. Wow, there are so many flowers around here. Okay, that's enough for now, I guess. Let me try and get back to my farm. We got some coconuts I must have missed last time. All right, let's just check my sprinkler situation. Everything looks good. I've got something here that 
can be harvested. My potatoes. Cool. Now that those are harvested, I can pick up this sprinkler. And let's see. These are all good. Uh, maybe I'll put it here. Well, that worked. Okay. Uh, I can't resist getting a bunch more flowers here. So yeah, that must be some kind of a uh, indicator of stamina. Because now it seems to be indicating even when I do the flowers. Okay, start putting some of this stuff away. I'm looking for the cheese. Huh. Okay. Did I maybe hit the button and put all the cheese away? No. Okay, so some of my tools look like they need worked on copper scythe, so I'll just grab the regular scythe for now, and my bug net, and I do have another bug net, so I won't need to buy one, and the rest of the stuff I think I'm gonna sell, except for the food. Uh, like the eggs, I mean, and the potatoes. Actually, 58 potatoes. I'm going to sell those, too. I'll just put the eggs away. Why is rain catching bugs? Oh, no. Oh, we have a visitor, and it's Julia. Theodore told me that I could host a bug catching comp while I'm visiting Paradise Ponds. I thought that sounded really, really fun. So that's what I'm doing today. Oh boy. I want to join. Yay, the comp log book is over on the table so you can sign up there. Theodore helped me write down the rules in it too if you don't know how to play. And I think I have to buy a net. Has she ever been here before, and have I ever done this before? I guess not. I don't see a, a net in there. Well, I did want to go to the mines today. But I guess I'm going to do the bug comp instead. Oops. wonder what time it starts. Okay, let me actually read the rules this time, because... Last time I signed up for the fishing comp and didn't realize I had to catch barracuda. Catch as many bugs as you can. The rarer the bug, the more points. Okay, it runs till 4 p.m. And we have to be back here before 4. 
Okay. I don't see any. <laughs> There's one. One point. And I see there was a croc over there. Six points for a monarch. Nice. So if John's running around catching bugs, I wonder if that means I can't sell anything to him in a shop. Ooh, there's a bunch of... Two points. One point. There's some meat in there too. It's like something bad happened. I thought I saw a bug over here. It was just that dog's tail. There's one. More crocs. Another one pointer. Oh boy. Let's see, what do I have on me that I can drop? I'll drop the centipede. And let me put a bunch of stuff in this chest. That should give me a lot of room. It also leaves me a little bit vulnerable because I think I just put away my spear. I don't see many bugs. Let's try over here. Make sure that there's not too many crocs around. One point. Oh no! Croc got that kangaroo. There's one. I'm going to try going over here. Two twenty four. Okay, so I saw that I've completed a daily task by running around, and it looks like I might have just completed another task that I have to open the book for, but I'll worry about that after the comp.
Let's see. The other one looks like either buying or planting seeds. Probably planting. And maybe watering. Oh, look at this. We got a bunch of <laughs> iron. I'm going to mark that and come back to it later. Okay, it's three o'clock. I'm gonna head back. Just catching bugs on the way and try not to go too far out of my way. Because I have gotten carried away and gone too long in the past. These birds are kind of weird. They're like... I don't know, maybe it's just because I'm looking for bugs, but it seems that they're behaving differently or something. Okay. I don't really see any more. So my score is 33. Maybe I should see who's winning. <gasps> oh my gosh, I'm doing terrible. Well. Oh. Oh, I do have my spear on me. That's good. Uh, before I head out there, though. I'm going to eat some crock meat. I can't because I'm inside. Okay. Oh, I dropped my spear. <laughs> uh. Okay, let's try that again. Gotcha. Okay, well, I'm going to take all this stuff out of here and sell it to John. don't want to sell the meat. And I bet Franklin's closed. I wanted to go into Franklin's. Yeah. So apparently, oh, John's closed too. Oh, it's a Sunday. That's why. Okay. I said in the beginning that it was Sunday, but then I completely forgot. So what I'm going to do is clear some space here. And then I'm going to put down a bunch of these bugs see the fastest way to do this.
I hate that some of these are placed differently than the others. Okay, if this was permanent storage, I would worry about how everything was placed and make sure it was all symmetrical, but just for tomorrow, I'm not going to worry about it. Uh, okay. Bug net. Fishing pole, compactor, helmet. Scythe, pickaxe, jackhammer. I should have made things easier for myself and taken these things in the order that I wanted them on my tool belt. Okay, I'll take the animal traps and the meat, but... And I guess the bug net. The rest of these things I'll just leave in here for tomorrow to sell. Okay, let's open this book and see what's going on. Okay, 200 permit points for walking 500 kilometers. Nice. Okay, water five crops. It's too late to plant six seeds unless I have some seeds just laying around. Let's take a look. Autumn and summer. And I don't have enough green bean seeds. Okay. Oops. All right. We got more permit points. So let's see, I've got nine, 14 open spots here. And these are permanent, so I could do one, two, three, five more there. So I could buy 19 more seeds if I wanted to be really uh, efficient with my watering. And what else did I want to do over here? Oh, I need scarecrows. So something else that's new is the um, advanced crafting table. Okay, pumpkin, gum log, and eight spin effects tuft. I think I just used all my spin effects. Yep. Okay, two gum logs. Oh, and there's some spin effects. Great. I just need a pumpkin. So, yeah, the advanced crafting table is like the um, workbench in Stardew Valley, and it allows you to craft things without having to back out like I just did and um, grab everything from the surrounding chest. So that'll be cool. So I don't have a recipe for the uh, the watermelon one, huh? 
I do. Okay, same thing. Gum log and spin effects. Uh, I think I have four spin effects left. Oh, wait, do I have any watermelon? I kind of thought that was a watermelon. That's a cabbage. Nope, don't even have it. Okay. We'll put these back. And I'll go place the scarecrow. hope that I have enough coverage. Alright, I never checked my traps this morning, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. Okay, well, I ran out of meat. I think I can put chicken in there. Or drumsticks, rather. I only have two. And I might remove that fencing from around there, because it, it's nice that I don't fall in, but it takes a really long time to remove the fences before I I fill them. That's why I keep uh, editing it out so that you guys don't have to sit there and watch me do that. Okay, so we got a bunch of stuff that hangs around on the ocean floor. We got some jelly, some thongs, and three keys. So I'm just going to head over and see what I can throw in here to sell to John. And I'm going to grab these other keys and throw them in my mining chest. And tomorrow... We'll go to John and buy the, um, the new hand cart from the autumn update, and we'll take that down into the mines with us. I'm really looking forward to using that so that I can bring back everything that I get in the mines. Looks like we need some fruit also now that I've been uh, using these billy cans I'm running out of fruit very quickly so let me see if any of these are ready to harvest I thought I saw some apples earlier I guess not Uh, maybe it was bush limes that I saw. Oh, no, there's some apples. I forgot I, like, randomly planted these trees over here one day when I had to do it for permit points. Because I didn't have room in my orchard. And while I'm... Oops, there's a crock right there. How's my health? My health is pretty good. But it looks like the crock meat maybe wears off. 
because uh, I definitely ate some crock meat earlier, and usually it keeps that health bar nice and big the whole day. It doesn't seem to be the case right now. Let's see, I don't know if I have time to really check this out, but let's see. Might as well put my helmet on. Okay, so I just ate some crock meat. Oops. Ah, it'll last for 12 minutes. Stamina regen and health. So it looks like it doesn't like super expand the bar anymore like it used to. I don't know if it's actually been nerfed or if it just uh, changes the, the look. Like, is it the same uh, buff or same effect, but it just doesn't show on screen the way it used to? I'm going to just grab some more of these flowers while I'm out here. And look around for some more bush lime trees. a lot of stuff to pick up out here. I don't know if it's uh, a lot of poop or if it's left over from when I was around here earlier. Oh, and it's late already. All right. I'm gonna take these bush lime and throw them in the billy can and then we'll go to bed. I just need to find my way home. There we are. quickly gonna cook up these crock of meat and tomorrow I think we'll uh, go to John and sell him all the stuff that we have in that uh, chest over behind his shop and then we're gonna head down to the mines I'm gonna buy a hand cart first if I can afford it Thanks for being here. I really appreciate it. I hope you join me again. Until then, stay safe and take care. Bye-bye.